वेलकम टू आर यूट्यूब चैनल ऑफ एप्लाइड फॉरेंसिक रिसर्च साइंसेस माय नेम इज़ मनीषा बोडकल एंड आई एम एन इंटर्न इन ए एफ आर एस टूडेज टॉपिक ऑफ प्रेजेंटेशन इज रेप केस दिस आर द कंटेंट्स ऑफ टूडेज टॉपिक वॉट इज रेप टाइप्स ऑफ रेप मेडिकल एग्जामिनेशन इन रेप केसेस कलेक्शन ऑफ फिजिकल एविडेंस डेट रेप सिनारियो स्टेटिस्टिक्स ऑफ इंडिया इन रेप केसेस केस स्टडीज एंड कंक्लूजन वॉट इज रेप रेप इज टाइप ऑफ सेक्शुअल असॉल्ट यूजली इन्वॉल्विंग सेक्शुअल इंटरकोर्स और अदर फॉर्म्स ऑफ सेक्शुअल पेनिट्रेशन कैरीड आउट अगेंस्ट अ पर्सन विदाउट देयर विल एंड कंसेंट इट कैन हैपन टू बोथ मैन एंड वुमेन ऑफ एनी एज एंड इट इज डिफाइंड अंडर सेक्शन थ्री सेवेंटी फाइव ऑफ आई पी सी पनिशमेंट एस्पेक्ट ऑफ रेप स्टेट्स दैट रिक्रेस पनिशमेंट नॉट लेस दैन टेन ईयर्स बट मे एक्सटेंड टू लाइफ इन प्रेजेंटमेंट एंड ऑल्सो लाइबल टू फाइन एंड इट इज डिफाइंड अंडर सेक्शन थ्री सेवेंटी सिक्स ऑफ आई पी सी देर आर डिफरेंट टाइप्स ऑफ रेप स्टैट्यूटरी रेप एडल्ट एंगेजिंग इन कॉन्सेंशुअल सेक्शुअल रिलेशंस विद सेक्शुअली मेच्योर माइनर्स अंडर द एज ऑफ कंसेंट मेराइटल और स्पाउजल रेप इन विच रेप कमिटेड बाय द पर्सन टू होम द विक्टिम इज लीगली मैरिड गैंग रेप वेन अ ग्रुप ऑफ पीपल पार्टिसिपेट इन अ रेप ऑफ सिंगल विक्टिम एक्विटेंस रेप और अ डेट रेप वेन द विक्टिम एंड द एक्यूज बोथ नो ईच अदर माइनर रेप इज वेन अ चाइल्ड इज रेप बाय एन एडल्ट and the last one there is corrective rape which is a criminal practice in south africa where men and uh, where men rape lesbian women as means of curing the women of her sexual orientation the medical officer examines the whole body and mentions all the types of injuries present on the body in the medical report anatomical diagram is made by the medical examiner in which all the injuries and scars are presented it is mainly used as medical legal evidence as and as a very important evidence in child sexual assault cases sometimes after the rape the victim may feel dirty and want to clean or bath or throw away their clothing so all the clothes and undergarments of the victim should be collected for evidence purpose presence of blood semen saliva bite marks and fingernail scrapings and other trace evidences like hair and fibers are used as evidence for dna testing vaginal specimen is collected with two cotton tip applicators and a portion is uh, smeared on microscopic slides and air dried and packaged in slide protector box the slide should never be stained or preserved in alcohol evidence collection is done for three purposes first to establish the penetration if the rape was actually happened or not or some false charges are put against someone else second to establish the non consensual intercourse which means if the intercourse is consensual or forceful which can be determined by torn clothing struggle signs bite marks etc and third is to establish the identity of the perpetrator which can be identified by the means of fingerprints hair blood stains semen samples or other trace evidences rape evidence should be refrigerated and submitted to the laboratory as soon as possible because biological evidence is deteriorates rapidly all the samples and the evidences should be collected in clean glass vials or fda cards but fda card is more preferable because the evidences will not get degraded easily and kept preserved for longer period of time blood saliva and urine samples of victim and all the suspect should be collected for comparative analysis and in date rape cases if any left over portion of the drink or the empty com- container in which it was served is available then it should be collected anal stains are observed into a clean cotton cloth or swab and air dried and packed in clean paper or an envelope and refrigerated and submitted to the laboratory wood examination is also done for uh, determining and used to compare wood particles which are found on clothing and other evidences on crime scene it is submitted in plastic or paper bags a recent front face photograph of victim is taken for superimposition to establish identity if skull is found then it is cleaned and dried and packed in paper investigators use semen detection kit and sexual assault kit for the collection of evidences found at the rape crime scenes when someone is forced to have sexual intercourse with someone who is in associated in voluntary social engagement a new material has been developed by undercover colors nail polish company which can detect certain rape drugs 
once applied to your finger nails swirl your finger in your drink if any drug is present then the nail polish will change the color it can detect rape drugs like ghb and roripinol rape drugs are mentioned such as roripinol which is used to treat sleep disorders ghb also called as gamma hydroxybutyrate ketamine which is also called as special k it is used as a general anesthetic extensively used in veterinary medicine and alcohol which is mostly easily accessible and most frequently associated with rape drugs are included to show that in 2012 68 cases of rape were registered every day but in 2013 92.34 four cases of rape were registered every day as per ncrb data so after the nirbhaya case there was an unexpected increase in the rape cases some case studies are mentioned first a man gang raped by four women in jalandhar a factory worker from jalandhar punjab has alleged that he was drugged and raped by four girls on december 5 2022 the victim reported that he was made unconscious and was also drugged before being raped for several hours and was dumped at a forest site at around 3 am and then following there are others case studies like nirbhaya gang rape case hathras rape case kathua gang rape and murder case offense of rape is grave in nature and it is also has a high impact on the victim as well as on the society at large for proving a heinous offense like rape there is a crucial need for medical as well as forensic evidence as their analysis and findings will bring a valuable insight in the court these are some of the references mentioned thank you everyone for listening to this topic i hope you have learned something productive from this if you have any doubts kindly comment down below please like and share our video also subscribe to our youtube channel to learn about more topics bye guys have a good day